In the realm of investment, the names Warren Buffett, Bill Gates, and Michael Burry shine as beacons of success, each carving their path to wealth through distinct avenues. Buffett's strategic acquisitions, Gates's pioneering role in the tech industry, and Burry's uncanny foresight in predicting market crashes have earned them legendary status. However, beyond their differences lies a shared appreciation for a rather unconventional asset, farmland. While the notion of investing in farmland may seem mundane compared to the flashy world of tech startups or high-stakes financial instruments, its resilience and consistent returns have captivated these renowned investors. Despite their diverse backgrounds, Buffett, Gates, and Burry have all recognized the unique benefits that farmland offers as an investment vehicle. The allure of farmland stems from its inherent stability and ability to weather economic storms. Welcome to Money and Investment, where your financial future starts today. Ever wondered why starting to invest when you're young is a game changer? Let's dive in. Investing in the stock market might seem daunting, but it's a powerful tool for building wealth. Why? It's all about time and compound interest. Starting young means more time for your investments to grow. Think of it like planting a tree. The earlier you plant, the longer it grows and the bigger it gets. Worried about risks? The earlier you start, the more time you have to recover and learn from market ups and downs. And if you're starting at 50, no worries. It's about choosing the right strategies suited to your stage in life. Unlike volatile stocks or speculative ventures, farmland provides a tangible asset with intrinsic value. Over the past five decades, median inflation-adjusted returns on farmland have averaged an impressive 6.1% per year, making it an attractive option for long-term investors seeking to hedge against inflation and recessionary pressures. In 2022, amidst a turbulent economic landscape, inflation-adjusted net farm income in the United States reached $167.3 billion, underscoring the enduring profitability of agricultural investments. Even during periods of market downturns, such as the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic, farmland values exhibited remarkable resilience, experiencing only marginal declines compared to the steep losses witnessed in other sectors. Warren Buffett, often lauded for his sage investment advice, has long been an advocate for farmland as a strategic asset class. Reflecting on his own journey, Buffett recalls purchasing his first farm in Nebraska during his high school years for a modest sum. Today, his extensive portfolio includes at least 400 acres of farmland, a testament to his unwavering belief in its long-term potential. During Berkshire Hathaway Inc.'s annual shareholder meeting in 2022, Buffett reaffirmed his commitment to farmland, stating, But I would say this, that if the people in this room uh, owned all of the farmland in the United States and you offered me a 1% interest in it, and you said for a 1% interest in all the farmland in the United States, uh, pay me, uh, pay our group, pay us this bargain price, $25 billion. I'll write you a check this afternoon, 25 billion. Now I own 1% of the farmland. His rationale is simple yet profound. Farmland represents a fundamental asset that generates essential resources, food, making it a reliable source of wealth generation. Similarly, Bill Gates, renowned for his technological innovations, has made substantial investments in farmland, amassing an impressive 270,000 acres across the United States. While his ownership accounts for a fraction of the total farmland in the country, it has raised eyebrows and prompted concerns about monopolistic practices. In response to criticisms, Gates defends his investments, emphasizing his commitment to enhancing productivity and creating employment opportunities within the agricultural sector. I have invested in these farms to make them more productive and create more jobs. There isn't some grand scheme involved. In fact, all these decisions are made by a professional investment team. Michael Burry, whose astute prediction of the U.S. housing market crash earned him widespread acclaim, has shifted his focus to agricultural land with abundant water resources. I believe that agricultural land, productive agricultural land with water on site, will be very valuable in the future," Burry remarked. 
His rationale reflects a departure from traditional investment strategies, aiming to capitalize on the stability and growth potential offered by farmland amid turbulent times. While the housing market remains susceptible to fluctuations, farmland's inelastic nature ensures a steady appreciation in value over time. With global food security concerns exacerbated by geopolitical tensions such as the Russia-Ukraine war, domestic agricultural farmlands are poised to remain in high demand, further bolstering their investment appeal. Finally, the convergence of interests among Warren Buffett, Bill Gates, and Michael Burry underscores the significance of farmland as a viable investment strategy. Beyond the glitz and glamour of high-risk ventures, farmland offers a tangible and enduring opportunity for wealth preservation and growth. As economic landscapes evolve and uncertainties persist, the resilience of farmland as an asset class continues to attract the attention of seasoned investors seeking stability amidst volatility. Ready to start your investment journey? Explore our channel for more insights on making smart, informed investment choices. Remember, it's never too late or too early to start investing in your future. Join us at Money and Investment for more tips and tricks on building your wealth. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss out.